Hi there everybody, welcome to my channel. For this tutorial, I'm going to be doing this eye look inspired by this Revlon nail polish. It's called Chameleon in number 933. So if you guys are interested, please continue watching. Alright guys, I'm going to start by priming my eyes with the Urban Decay Shadow Primer. And I'm going to put that all over my eyelid. And I'm just using my fingertip to blend that in. Next, I'm going to go with the Kylie Bible palette and I'm going to be taking the lightest shade and I'm going to set the eyeshadow that I just applied for a smoother surface and for a better application of the eyeshadows. And then I'm going to go with this brand new Nubian 2 eyeshadow palette by Juvia's Place and I'm going to be taking the color Kenya and I'm going to apply that on my crease area with a nice fluffy brush that is from Amazon. Next, I'm going to go with the Morphe 35S palette and I'm going to be taking the dark matte eyeshadow using the e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush. I'm going to be packing that color onto my lid. Not too much though because I am going to be layering it with another eyeshadow coming up. Next, I'm going to be going with the same palette, the Morphe 35S palette and I'm going to be using my angle brush and applying that on the same area where I applied the matte eyeshadow. This is such a gorgeous emerald green and I've been meaning to use this eyeshadow for a while but I haven't so I'm glad I got a chance to use it. Next I'm going to go with the smaller blending brush from BH Cosmetics and I'm going to be going with the same crease color that's from the Nubian 2 palette adding that on the crease area and blending it with the other colors. As usual, I like to go back and blend out the crease area with a bigger fluffy brush that I used earlier and make sure the transition is as smooth as possible. For the center part of the eye, I'm going with this gorgeous, when I say gorgeous, I mean gorgeous eyeshadow from the same Nubian 2 eyeshadow palette. And I'm going to be applying that on the center of my eyelid. This eyeshadow is so buttery, oh my gosh you guys, it just, huh. I might do, I'll most likely do actually, a reveal on this palette anyway, so I think it deserves a shout out for real. To give this look that yellowish coppery type of situation <laughs> color, I'm going to be going with the darkest shade of highlighter from the Carly Bible palette and top it on top of the green one. There's a lot of layering in this look, as you guys can see. And then I'm going to go with a little bit of that emerald green eyeshadow and my angle brush and basically sweeping it in towards the center to blend those eyeshadows together. Next, I'm going to take Zuri and apply that on my brow bone and also on my inner corners later on. For the bottom eyelid, I'm going to go with the Morphe Warm Pro Definition Palette and uh, with this brown shade, I'm going to put that on the bottom eyelid and smudge it out with whatever is already on the bottom. And then I'm going to apply my Rimmel London Wonder Lash Mascara and then go with my Ardell Wispies Lashes. For my lips, I use the ColourPop Calypso, I think it's called, from the Ultra Matte Liquid Lipstick. I actually wanted to go with a bolder color but I thought there was too much going on already so I went with the, a little bit of a subtle lip color. So that's pretty much it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This <laughs> I almost said DIY designer DIY girl. <laughs> anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and for more videos, don't forget to subscribe. And let me know in the bottom section if this is a look that you guys might rock for at the new year or really any other time. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye!